dearest human, why are you still awake? It is well past a reasonable hour, and you know all too well. <laughs> More than that, you need to come to bed so I can spend the night with you. Ah, <sighs> did that send a shiver down your spine? <laughs> Are you finally ready to come find me again? To find your way into my embrace? <sighs> come on now, my dear human. I've missed you so much through the day. And I absolutely hate that you still have not yet come to see me. You know the only time I can reach you with more than my voice is in your dreams. And yet, you still refuse to close your eyes. And allow me to finally have you. You spend hours staring at screens and working when you know you should be resting. You stress yourself until you fray at the edges and then continue to stress yourself even more. I just don't understand it. And I want to take care of you. My dear, your mind needs rest. You need rest. And just as much as rest, you need care. If you're not going to provide it to yourself, then you should at least allow me to provide it for you. Oh, <laughs> but I can see the way your fingers hesitate. My words have caught your ear like a melody. And now they've tainted your thoughts. <laughs> tainted your thoughts with the feeling of warm, fuzzy bed. Fresh sheets. And a cozy pillow. It's a tempting idea, is it not? To allow me to spoil your weary mind and body. It could be more than a tempting thought, my dear. I could bring you to euphoria. Allow you to finally, fully, relax, rest against me. You know the feel of my skin against yours? Just imagine it now. My hands running over your back. 
my nails softly tracing over your skin. In those nonsensical swirling patterns that you love to get lost in. My lips against the shell of your ear. Whispering sweet nothings against your skin. And it calms you like waves against the shore. Mm, my chest rising and falling in a hypnotic rhythm under your hand. Mm. Sounds like bliss. Mm -hmm. Certainly to me, that is. And from the way your eyes have fallen shut at my musings, I would hazard a guess that it sounds heavenly to you as well. <laughs> Teasing you? No, dear human. I would never tease you in such a way. I want nothing more than to bring you peace and relaxation. And though I won't deny, I may have my own motivations for my persistent urging you to go to bed. <laughs> Mm-hmm, indeed. You know that already, though, don't you? I can tell from that knowing smirk. So wicked, yet so inviting. Well, if I must admit to my motivation, to get you to come to bed with me, then I may as well tell you each and every one. First, I'd like to have the pleasure of seeing you again, as lovely as it is to be able to whisper. I can only see you when I'm in your dreams. And I do so greatly enjoy being able to see surprise on your cute little face when I pull you close. <laughs> Not to mention that soft little smile you give me after we kiss. Which leads me to my second reason that I must continue to urge you to sleep. I want to kiss you again. More than that, I crave it. With a hunger that knows not how to let me rest. Mm, the way your lips feel against mine. The way you whisper my name. As you lay your head. 
head on my shoulder. After we finally kissed each other breathless. Um, the final reason is that because when you're asleep, I know that I am the only one to have you in my embrace. When you're asleep, you belong to me. You're all mine. And when you're with me, no other human can try to seduce you and steal you away from me. <laughs> when you find me in your dreams, I know it's because you chose to find me. And that you're mine. I know that I have your heart more than any other human or demon. Just as you have mine. And I will not allow you to take your heart back and give it to anyone else. You promise, do you? But, you seem so devoted to your screens, to the messages you read, and the voices you hear from them. Then provide it to me, dear human. Come to bed with me, and let me have you all to myself. Give yourself to me, and I'll give you heaven in return. Oh, what's this? Have I finally convinced you to come to bed? Excellent. It's good to know that my words have such a strong effect on you. <laughs> Fine. I'll talk more about how adorable I find it. That I can charm you with my honeyed words. Or how I plan to do so. Many more times in the future. <laughs> oh, please, my dear, don't get riled up by my teasing. I've finally convinced you to bed. It wouldn't do any good for you to get stuck in anger. I would hate for agitation. Especially since we both know you enjoy the way I tease you. <laughs> mm, what a cute little scowl, though. I will admit, I prefer when you're smiling at me in the sweet way that you do. Please, lay down in your bed and wrap yourself in blankets. Allow me to earn that enchanting smile of yours. Hmm. Yes, that's good. Just like that. Get nice and cozy. Hmm. Now. Just listen to my voice, and let your eyes 
slowly close. Breathe. And feel your breathing even out as my voice. Feel that relaxation from the top of your head, flow all the way down to the tip of your toes. Now slowly open your eyes again. <laughs> oh, hello, my dearest love. It's been far too long. <laughs> yes, I know. It had only been since this morning since I've seen you. But hell is such a boring place to spend my days. rather spend my time next to you in your bed. <laughs> mm -hmm. Now come here. I am so tired of waiting to have you back in my arms. Mm -hmm. Oh, there we are. Doesn't this feel so good? Am I warm enough for you, my dear human? Mm, that's good. Wrap your arms around me a little tighter so I can warm you up even more. Hmm. <laughs> that caught me off guard. I only had intended to invite you to cuddle, as I know how much you love to do. However, I'm not objecting. <laughs> now, now, my dear, don't start getting embarrassed. It might have been a little surprise, but I promise it was a welcome one. I'm very eager to repeat it. <laughs> I miss the feeling far too much. of my hand on your waist, draw that enticing shiver from you. 
Mm, how adorable. Mm. <laughs> mm. Perhaps I should use my other hand to hold your face. Since I know you just purr at the feeling of my thumb brushing over your cheek. Mm -hmm. You like the sound of that, don't you? Welcome closer, my dear. Allow me to feel the warmth of your skin against my palm. Mm, there's a lovely smile. So sweet and only for me. One that I shall keep all to myself. And the moments we're together are far too fleeting. You know I could hold on to you forever. If the universe would allow it. I wish I could be with you for every moment of our lives. It's my only greatest wish. You're right, dearest. Of course you are. I should not linger on such thoughts of despair when you are here with me. I should instead maybe pester you to share your lips with me again, so that I may cherish the taste of ambrosia and bliss that your mouth holds. Perfection. Every bit of you is perfection. I swore it when I first saw you, and I'll swear it until the end of time. And I just wish you would realize how much of a treasure you are. And I wish you would take better care of yourself. I know, my love. But I just love you too much not to say it. You need more sleep. And that's not just so that you can see me again. As much as I do. You need your rest so you don't collapse in on yourself, like you have so many times before. Mm, and if the only way I can get you to sleep is to seduce you into your bed, 
<laughs> then I will gladly do so. Of course, gladly. I'll now lay your head on my chest. Let me hold you close. So I can whisper stories. It's very considerate of you, love, but if I were to receive as many kisses as I need from you, you wouldn't get any rest at all. So for now, you just rest here in my arms, and let me enjoy being in your presence. Mm. Well, since you insist, I suppose that you can steal more kisses, should you wish to. <laughs> but only as long as you try your best to rest and recover, too. You promise? Good. Then kiss me to your heart's content, and I'll keep you safe as you sleep. Oh, my dear, I love you so much. Sleep well. <laughs>